Some Hurricane Harvey victims will miss spending the holidays in the comfort of their own home. However, there are some positive signs that housing will soon be on the way for those folks. Chris 6 News reporter Ashley Portillo explains. What looks like hundreds of trailers lined up at this former Naval Air Station in Beeville is actually a hold facility. Well, I'm homeless, you know, right now, so be helpful. I'm, I'm, I hope I get one of those, so be a new beginning for me to have a place. The trailers are stationed here at Chase Field before they are transported to Harvey victims in the area. But storm victims hope the process goes a bit quicker as the winter season approaches. It makes me very sad. There's so many people here that need a home, especially this time of year. It's cold and it's Christmas. Who doesn't want to be in their new home for Christmas after the storm, you know, devastated everything. RVs and trailers also undergo a final inspection at the former airfield. Any necessary repairs are also made there. And when households are approved by FEMA, the work order goes into place. On average, it takes about 15 days for a manufactured home to be installed. And it's not a simple process. But the GLO says it's moving families into homes quicker than previous disasters. It just takes time. Things are working all right. You know, things are coming together. Ashley Portillo, Chris 6 News. Well, so far, more than 700 trailers are being occupied by families. Work will continue through the holidays to process more of them and make sure they quickly get to people as quickly as possible. It's